My name's Will Chapman. I'm a HPB and liver transplant surgeon based at Washington University in St. Louis. The AHPBA has, has had as a mission the goal of education and training, um, research innovation, development of new technologies and research, really all focused around HPB disorders. Now this is a really kind of a niche area in surgery um, and, and for managing complex disorders um, you know you really can learn a lot from your colleagues around the country who have similar interest. So for me having the opportunity to meet with other surgeons and clinicians who have those same interests um, you really expand um, considerations and opportunities for your patients. You think about new ideas that you wouldn't have thought for, of before. You improve your training programs for your trainees. Um, you really can totally rethink the way you approach HPB disorders. The personal benefits have come from the great friends that, that I've made through the association. We have um, great colleagues that we now get together, call, email. So these have been um, really uh, incredible benefits to me. I can think of a lot of examples where the AHPBA has benefited me in specific areas, but um, we just last year put in place a new protocol using pump chemotherapy for patients with intrahepatic cholangiocarcinoma who couldn't, who didn't have other treatment options. I learned about this from a colleague in the AHPBA. I don't think I would have stumbled on this idea. It would just isn't out there. There are only a couple of places that have used this approach, and uh, we put the protocol in place. We put. Uh, now 10 patients on an IRB approved protocol that uh, I wouldn't have considered before. So, you know, that's just one example of the type of areas where it's been beneficial. I think anyone interested in disorders of the liver, bile duct, pancreas, um, really should strongly consider joining the AHPBA. Um, you know, there are really kind of three broad groups that train and uh, have uh, educational programs in HPV disorders. The AHPBA, the SSO, Society of Surgical Oncology, and the ASTS, the American Society of Transplant Surgeons. And, and the AHPBA has members from all three organizations, obviously the AHPBA, but the SSAT and the SSO. Um, and so we have a lot of overlap, particularly in the areas of liver and pancreas transplant and HPB disorders. So to me, if you have any involvement in the, a, in the HPB diseases, whether you're a surgeon or a non-surgeon, you ought to think about joining the AHPBA.